Hello everybody. Happy Thursday here at Dallas Vintage Toys. Just taking a look at our at our slanted ceiling of of the tile ceiling tile art done by help from the help of Astro. He's an amazing uh, amazing artist. Really cool stuff and there's like never really show this in our videos. So there, there's many more in the ceiling, you know. So it's like a Joker Joker Oh, it's upside down. Whoops. <laughs> but many others on the ceiling. If you get here, just look up and you know, there's a vintage Boba Fett up here. <laughs> so, um, <clears throat> yeah. And uh, let's show off our uh, toy collections that we have that are usually behind the counter. Uh, take a look uh, here. We got the got the snake guys right there. The Voltron. We got the uh, Combiner Wars Devastator, Super Seven Optimus. Got the uh, Battle Convoy, uh, Diaclone. We got the, the Voltron One there, Ultraman. We got the Firehouse. All kinds, all kinds of the goodies. <coughs> Excuse me, clear my throat. The Mafex, a bunch of Mafex Batman figures here. Some Deadpool and the Green Arrow. Here, there's a little Mighty Max Skull Mountain right there. That red, that red little mountain right there is from Mighty Max. Got some uh, Nintendo stuff here that you can see. And as you go down, there's more of the Nintendo games here. Here in the display case. And then it transforms into Transformers. I'm sorry. <clears throat> Bunch of loose modern Transformers here in the case. People buy stuff from here all the time. We have really good, really good selection of modern Transformers. And as you go this way by the counter, uh oh, someone tore that. Almost, <clears throat> almost bumped into it. Some uh, heavy hitter toys here. We got some Storm Collectibles, Mortal Kombat. These are the uh, very rare ones right now. The Ermac, MK3 Scorpion. Noob Cybot, Goro, Rain. There's a classic scorpion right there. And we got the the human smoke. You can't really see. He just blends in with the shadows. <laughs> Some more up here. Yeah, in case anyone was wondering, that little that bag of the accessory sets of the green pipe goes with that figure arts Mario. So if you buy this Mario, we're throwing that in there. Mega Man, oh, Black oh. Series, Star Wars. Black Series Star Wars. Japan Pro Wrestling. <clears throat> oh, I think someone's at the door. Oh, was it Aaron? <laughs> you, Here you go. Morning, Aaron. Morning. Morning. <laughs> Morning, everyone. Morning. <laughs> Fabulous day at Dallas Vintage Toys. Yes. Neck of Turtles. Mix of the movie and the Toon Turtles. Any new baths by by Butcha? Butcha, I'm sorry if I'm saying your name correctly, sir. Uh, but any new baths? Uh, not really. Haven't had any in a, in a while. Um, we, I mean, we still gotten some in recently, but it's all like the duplicates, so no new ones really. So, uh, <clears throat> here's a look at our NECA stuff, NECA horror, action, sci-fi, a couple of video game NECA figures, and now uh, we got these in. We got the uh, Troubles of Foot. You want to feel him? Okay. All right, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go see Scott. Scotty. Hello, Hello sir. Is this, <laughs> yeah, is this coffee with Scott? This is coffee with Scott. I'm just going through your emails, trying to get all the situations handled, trying to get everybody the toys they need. 
but what I wanted to say, let's uh, take a walk here. Okay. What I wanted to say is, we got a really cool collection of Star Wars stuff. I'll be on camera and let me show them what I'm doing too. Oh. I'm doing something too. Oh, okay. <laughs> Transformers G1. Oh, he's serious. A lot of them have already sold when I started that yesterday. Okay. That's a 1221 back. Uh, we got some Joes and then we got some lovely Starcom that we got to shoot. And now we can follow Scott. Mm. We got all these, we got all these shoes for sale. All these shoes are for sale, right, Sean? No, it's good. I no, actually have sale. the Chunky Donkey Ben and Jerry's being shipped to me. Really? Now that's my Grell shoe. So. <laughs> the Chunky Donkeys. Right. Available only at Ben and Jerry <laughs> Night. Scott does everything he talks about, I'm sure. <laughs> so this is a pretty cool rank for that legacy one right Look there. at all this stuff, man. And Sean picked all this stuff indoor. while I was gone yesterday. Mm -hmm. Got big, some, uh, get some of the this big, is a really cool set. Look at this. Big the Jumbo Beast Wars figures there. This is my favorite from this set. That one's Battle cool. Indoor. This is a workout I did this morning. The Gut Cruncher. The Gut Cruncher? What is it? Oh, it's also an Action Master Transformer. Oh, the it's Gut the, Cruncher. You did that, the Gut Cruncher? Uh, we got some of these uh, <laughs> Movie Maniacs in. I think there's like three or four of those in. Pumpkin head. Lots of uh, loose modern Star Wars vehicles. Why we boxed items. So we'll get all this prize today. We'll get it out for you. So yeah, I'm gonna go back to those emails. <laughs> I heard something. Oh, 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 what's, what's going on? Do 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 do. Let's go now. Back out into the world of toys. <clears throat> Let's start off with, okay, so David Patrick Vasquez says, how does layaway work, and how long do you have to get it out? Well, it depends. If you put something on layaway that's under $100, you have two weeks to get it out, but if it's over $100, we can work something out. It depends uh, how big the price of the item is. We'll work out a date of when you can get it out. <clears throat> so you put 25% down of the product. That's after tax. So 25% down of the after tax, and the after tax number. So... <clears throat> But anyway, <clears throat> I forgot to show these off yesterday, all the stuff along the top of the case. I forgot to show that off. Sometimes I forget to do that. Got the Buck Rogers set and a vintage Spider-Man toy and Batman and Wonder Woman. Well, well, this Batman is modern, but I think it's an actual legit vintage uh, Wonder Woman figure. Yeah, 1983. Got the mask behind him. Okay. Urkel, Urkel doll, the big GI. I, for, I forgot what that thing is called. I, I know what it is. It's just on the tip of my tongue. <clears throat> Got it. Uh, beautiful Grimlock toy. I, I couldn't say beautiful all the way. Couldn't say it. But that this is Grimlock. This is the big. It's like a big jumbo transformer toy of Grimlock. <clears throat> Castle of Lions playset. AT, AT, it's the one from, uh, oh my god, Rogue One, I think? Yes. Luke Skywalker with Yoda. Mmm, chilling on my back, on his back I am. Ninja Turtles, Tricycle, the Avengers na uh, Nano Gauntlet, the Marvel Legends Nano Gauntlet, the one you can actually move the fingers, you can actually wear it. Um, this Millennium Falcon in a case. It's not graded. It's just someone brought a, uh, or we got a, a case for it. We just slapped it in there. But it's, uh, it's in good shape. So, it's all there. <clears throat> yeah, Joe, Phantom X-19 Stealth Fighter. Here, let me slide that out here without knocking anything over. Look at that. Woo, that is really nice. Really nice. And the... Cobra, oh my god, stuck. Okay. Cobra bug. Look at that thing. Nice, big, and green. The vehicles that it comes with. This is really cool. Cobra bug with the box. Everything with the box. Let's see if I can. Oh, 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 oh. And the Cobra Night Raven. Whoa, look at that. Box is not in the best of shape, but it's a box nonetheless. It's the box nonetheless. <clears throat> G.I. Joe playset. Uh, 
Donnie and Marie Osmond TV show playset. Because why not? If you need one, come here to Dallas Vintage Toys. If you're a Donnie Marie Osmond fan, we got them. We got the, uh, what is this right here? Yeah, it sticks <laughs> I keep reading that thing, it's sticky. <clears throat> see action football game. Yeah. I guess that means you can see the action. Okay. Can't put it back now. <clears throat> Knock out the enemy base for the Cobra battle game. From Hasbro. <clears throat> we got it. This is a modern one, but this is that modern Walmart re release of the Cobra Hiss. It comes with it's the actual vintage one, the vintage uh, mold of the toy, but it's a modern figure. So it's like a, it's like a 25th anniversary version of the uh, of the Cobra Hiss driver. Arms getting tired. Use the other arm. Get some more GI Joe vehicles up here. We got a big, big honking tank. Iron Knight. Look at that. How much for the Team of T Techno Drones cat vehicle and the Shredder Mobile loosened glass case with that? Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, it is uh, two ninety, two eighty nine, ninety nine. And what did you ask for the scan vehicle and the Shredder Mobile loosened the um, oh Shredder Mob Mobile, Shredder Mobile, excuse me, Shredder Mobile. Um, that's it right there, isn't it? Forty five. Shoulders off while we're in here. More Centurions, Ninja Turtles, G1 Transformers, a little bit of GoBots here and there, some mask vehicles down there, a little bit of Ghostbusters down there. I like the uh, Skylink. He's like, oh, how long am I going to be in here? <clears throat> Got some cool uh, Godzilla figures, little vinyl figures. Ultraman. Look at that one. Man. Ultraman right here. My Motu classics of the uh the Princess of Power Girls. And there's there's a oh words on the way. There's Catra. There's a, a Cyclone. He-Man spread and get back. He-Man. More He-Man figures. Here's a mix of uh, some vintage toys, more mix of vintage toys here. Got a little E.T. I think it's a, yeah, it's a bank, a little bank. There's some Jurassic Park dinosaurs. These are the modern ones. It's not older ones. It's like more all the modern stuff that you see. Vintage play sets. There's some DC figures. Dick Tracy figures. Let me move this. It's Darth Vader. Box. You open it. There's another box. Open that. It's another box. Open that. It's empty. <clears throat> Anybody remember this movie? Warriors of Virtue? I sure do, and I don't want to. Old figures, Power Rangers. And no, actually, it's modern. Excuse me. Power Rangers are old, but these figures are not. So. <clears throat> got E.T. He's just been chilling here ever since we opened. He just never left. He got his Reese's Pieces. Let me fix that up. This is a little more shiny. Yeah. That's fine. Um, I'm not. I'm not. I swear to God, I'm not. <laughs> we got all oh, the lights not on. I need to turn it on. But yeah, it's supposed to be a light on the bottom here. But this is the screen used prop replica. Uh, not prop replica, not a replica, excuse me. The actual screen used dagger from the Dolph Lundgren Masters of the Universe movie. Yeah. <clears throat> we got the, still have the uh, HasLab Unicron. It's been opened, but never really taken out of the box. It was, it was opened, I guess the person that brought it in had it for inspection and just sold it to us, but it's been resealed. So it's all, it should, it's all there. It's all there. We got Jeffrey still wearing his mask, being safe. We got the NECA life-size gremlin. I think, it's, I think I was just called the brown gremlin. And before we enter, Castle Grayskull, there is a warning. Please do not touch Castle Grayskull or we will throw you in the dungeon. This dungeon. Watch out for the monsters. You'll walk around.
Yesterday I walked around one side. I'm going to walk around the other side. <clears throat> and here we are. We made it safe. But this is really cool, though. There's the door. It's open. Got some uh, mix of like, kind of miscellaneous graded stuff here. <clears throat> like some Dukes of Hazards of uh, Boss Hogs, a couple of Black Hole figures, Arak the Destroyer. I'm sorry, Arak Son of Thunder. Excuse me. It's Arak the Destroyer. Pardon me, guys. Uh, some graded Atari games. Got some uh, uh, graded card packs. They've never opened. It's those, it's those display boxes that you see in stores that you just take one little pack for a couple dollars, and there you go. So those are just never open. So some mass vehicles, Go Bots, Secret Wars, Superpowers. So we've got a couple of Joe vehicles here, and we got the uh, Terror Drone, Terror Drone. Excuse me. Jurassic Park Electric Command Compound Graded. Jurassic Park. More Jurassic Park Graded. More, more uh, miscellaneous graded stuff. This is all like just more modern stuff. Uh, here's the uh, 40th anniversary Black Series Boba Fett, but in his vintage color. Painted like the vintage figure. I think that's the, the Comic Con exclusive one. Modern Nia Jones. Phalo from Clash of the Titans. Turbo Man, a vintage Turbo Man. Not the new one. This is actual vintage, uh, the original Turbo Man figure, graded. Star Wars display case. <clears throat> loose graded Star Wars. More loose graded Star Wars. Do you buy Bionic 6 toys? Uh, I don't think we do. It just depends. We can take a look at them. So, thank you, Robbie, for the question. Indiana Jones, loose and um, and loose and carded, graded. <clears throat> Mask toys, strawberry shortcake miniatures. This is a this is a shipper case of the figures, which is I think it's of these. So these little strawberry shortcake graded. Now, as I say, this is mask. Here's a bunch of mask vehicles. <laughs> we got the we got the buzzard, the bullet. The Iguana, Firefly, Goliath, more Goliaths, and then it turns into Ninja Turtles, the graded Ninja Turtles. We got, we got, we got all four of the turtles, multiples of each one, but we got a few of the bad guys, Shredder, Foot Soldier, and Bebop. We got Donnie in disguise. Yeah, but yeah, this is, yeah, this is our only graded Ninja Turtles at the moment. Um, here's... <clears throat> The graded G.I. Joe. You got your Storm Shadow. You got your Fuse. You can't really see from here. Zap. More graded Stone Wars. Can you show me two Temple of Doom figures? Like the graded ones? Uh, yes. We got one right here. Like there's one here. No, wait, no, it's not. Oh, yeah, there they are. Right there. I mistake that figure for uh, Molarom, so. But there he is right there. <laughs> yeah, Temple of Doom figures right there. I think that's the only graded ones that we have. <clears throat> we have back to the graded Star Wars. Some Jedi, Power of the Force. The graded Rancor right there. All in his lonesome. Return of the Jedi. The speeder bike, but it's like a swing. You put on your swing set. If, you, if anybody still has a swing set for their kids. Come get this. I think they would love it. We got a thermostat here for sale. No. <clears throat> Han Solo and Carbonite. He's just chilling. He's been chilling in the corner. 
or great at Star Wars. Check them out here. Jose, hello from Spain. Looking forward to visit your shop next year. Yes, sir. Hoping to see you too, man. Looking forward to seeing you too next year, dude. <clears throat> graded Transformers. More graded Transformers. The graded Millennium Falcon spaceship. I don't know why I keep saying graded. Because they are, but I think we everyone gets the gist of it now when you go in here. More carded Star Wars. More, more, more. Mo, mo, mo. More Star Wars. That's it from this room. Let's go. Let's walk back over here. Here's the He Man wall. This is the same gentleman that did our artwork on the ceiling, all the ceiling tiles. His name is Astro. Look at that. <clears throat> and then when you go over here, here's a bunch of the modern Star Wars sets. Like from the uh, collector series, like the big 12 inch figures. And if you turn around, some loose, I was about to say Transformers, <laughs> loose Marvel Legends and Ninja Turtles, DC. Uh oh. Peely fell over. I need to stand him up after this video. We got Batman on the guitar. Yeah. Recently put in some new figures in yesterday. Here's all the DC. Here's the gentle giant Boba Fett. The vintage Boba Fett. The actual vintage figure. It's like it's my science. It's my science. Got a the remote control Megazord. Doesn't have the sword, but he has the shield. So and here's the uh, Batman playset. The Mansion playset. The Wayne. Ma excuse me. The Wayne Manor playset. I used to have this. I used to have this as a kid. Oh, King Batman just, just chilling. Just chilling, just having fun. Can we stop making all that racket? <laughs> Lady Death. I gotta show the Lady Death. The Lady Death Coffin Comics. I have that figure. I recommend, I highly recommend this figure. Come on to Dallas Vintage Toys and ask about it, talk about it, and we will sell it to you. Here's the Star Wars Black Series, Star Wars Vintage Collection figures, Power of the Force 2, Episode 1. Someone asked, do we still have the Bubble Fat Hot Toy? Bubble Fat Hot Toy? Uh, I don't know. I'm not oh, sure, yes, but it should still be in the, the case there. <laughs> more, more Star Wars. Rocky. Wrestling figures, AEW, the Legends of Lucha Libre. Some of the NECA stuff here, some McFarlane stuff here, like the Mortal Kombat and the Warhammer. Aliens, Predators. Westworld, anybody watch that show? We got some Westworld figures. Got the Metal Greymon statue from Digimon. Mo2 Origins, deluxe figures, mix of DC figures, it's a little bit of Marvel. Here's some of the, here's the other section of wrestling figures. We're in the middle of moving stuff in around, so moving stuff around, so trying to reorganize our shelves. That's why it looks like that. Some Mattel DC figures, McFarlane DC figures. some uh, G.I. Joe uh, classified series, excuse me, had a brain fart there, Power Rangers, Power Rangers, Marvel Legends, here's all the Marvel Legends, here. that's all we got, we got the, uh, the newer Retro Rogue, which is the best Rogue to have right now, Retro Rogue, uh, Doctor Doom, yeah, Scott, what we got going on here? Let's go. What we got going on here? Oh, for that GI Joe collector that just has to have everything. Here's <laughs> all the paperwork. <laughs> Here it is. 
Yeah, we, uh, yesterday I asked Scott, and I was like, or he was doing this, I was like, I thought we finished them. And you're like, Trevor, how long do we have? Like, years worth of, uh, books? Or a paper? We did 94, and we've gotten, uh, <laughs> this is 87, so we still have tons of the books. Man, 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 oh man. Got plenty. All right, guys, well, thank y'all for tuning in. Check us out on, uh, Don't Instagram, boys, Instagram and Facebook, YouTube. And, uh, ooh, wait a minute. Oh, yeah, these are, I think, Beast from Wars. Beast Wars. I'm show that off for a second. Beast Wars. Transformers. Ooh, and there's there's an Aaron. Is it Aaron for sale? How much are you, Aaron? Huh? Hey, are you for sale? I'm, I'm a, I am for sale. I you are for sale? Yes. <laughs> and I come with a lot. I come with all these toys, too. Look at this. <laughs> you come with all these some toys? Beast Wars, Transformers <laughs> that came in yesterday. Got some, uh, Transformers, the movie. The, mo the, the 2007 movie figures. Uh -huh. I wanted I wanted that uh, tank the brawl I wanted him so bad. When I first saw him, I was like, "Oh my God, who is he? Who is he?" And then I was like, "Oh, his name's Brawl." I was like, "Oh man." Yeah, they call him they call him Devastator in the movie, but it's because uh -huh. you know Michael Bay he likes to do it. He's <laughs> gonna combine. <laughs> no, he doesn't. That's what that's what the There's bummer Megatron, about that. We got a Megatron. 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 We got a Transformers robot. This guy Scourge. A Scourge. Yeah, that's very rare. Let's yeah, see. yeah. The guy, the, the guy brought them in loose, but, but kept the boxes. So that's yeah. why it looks like that. Transmetal Beast Wars <gasps> Rampage. Rampage. Yeah, I used to have him. Looks pretty good. What else did we get? Oh, that's Tiger Hawk. Tiger Hawk. Tiger Hawk. Too. That is uh, Tiger Tron and Air Razor combined. That's when they come back. That's right. Spoilers for the show. Oh, sorry. Yo, it's been about 30,000 years since the show guys. came out. So anyway, that's it, guys. Thank you all for watching. Check us out. You know, like I said, YouTube, Instagram, Facebook. Y'all take care.